No, nope. okay, never mind. We are giving it. I think we're gonna lose, and then this will be it. The Grandar, good to see you here. Pretty fun looking deck, John. This thing is wild. That Dave, though, brewed up something. I'm freaking masterpiece. I've changed four cards in it, and that's it. It is a masterpiece. Which is, by the way, like, so respectable, because, like, I never get a chance just to say, yeah, I think we're gonna lose here. This is gonna be the moment where I lose it. Because we do need to, like, basically have the 10 card combo. To get the points you need to win all in the next round instantly, you need the 10 card combo. That you click this, making a bomb, and then you can just play any removal spell, and I'm a goner. Oh. War will be our downfall. This I have seen. Okay. The day is nigh when all shall behold my beauty. I should have played the select here. We'll see. Maybe. I don't think I don't it doesn't look like double last, right? It looks like an orb deck. I think it's orb greeb. If it's orb yes. greeb, we'll be good. That would fit perfect. Rubbish in, rubbish out. Fine. Pass and forget. Not I. What am I missing here? I'm missing two, two cards. Fine. Um. So I guess. I guess at this point, I'm playing curse scroll. Get the Braxis. Get rid of Siege Ladder. Braxis, go. Ah, oh, it was painful, Piv. So, now, so weirdly enough, this is the turn where you go off. And you go from three to eight, but so now you're ten. Arch Griffin, go. Now it's you, buff, buff. This year, death and blood are specters between us. Buff you. Hit. Casting contest. And turn. Hit. Casting contest. Here we go, guys. I'm getting better. I'm growing up. Put you away. Hit. Hit. Casting. Hit. Enter it. There we go. There we go. There we go. Leticia triggers, doubles, uh, adds patience value to all allied units. It does not exclude their self. Does not exclude their self. Therefore, we get to play some really dirty stuff here. This hand's perfect. There's no other cards I want in my deck. We need Mancy for Erland. We got Envoy just as a unit. Uh, maybe front row is better. Yeah, I'm not saying the wording shows doubling at all. Certainly. Uh, notice at the end of turn, patience values of all allied units increase by whatever amount it is. She's a patience unit. She's part of that all. That's what's going on. All right, Simless, I'm looking forward to seeing how you do this one. Erland? A witcher with no honor is no brother of mine. Celebrant top. Oh, actually, it is Envoy. Play against random serpents. Yeah, I should have clicked this to avoid a serpent. Well, they would kill it anyways. I can't really protect this uh, that. 
Or it has to be a reset to be effective. Yeah, and also her order is word really weird. It's end of the turn. So I can't click her and buff up everything. I have to click her, wait another turn, and then everything gets seen, basically. Pretty awesome. Uh, yeah, I think uh, 173 points plus the rest. Yeah, this is looking fine, guys. So it's AA. I think um, Radovids might be the most here. Well, you're going to be 8, 7, but you have to get... No, I think it's Mentor. I lied. Mentor. Go back. Yeah. Go! Yeah, okay, guys. This thing is popping. This one's popping. This deck is insane. Holy crap. Oh my gosh. That Dave, though, you're a genius. It's the best deck I've seen in forever. This is the saddest thing. Can I, can I get a deck list? I can hook you up with. You can either take. I have Dave's here. That's what I've been working off. But Dave is the mad genius who put this together. I'm gonna swap it over to English because I know this is an English stream, so I imagine most of you speak English. Here you go. And let me hook you up with my version of it afterwards. Honestly, that Dave, by the way, this is one of the most refined decks I've ever, I think, played on this channel. I swapped four cards and they were all very minor. You're brilliant. This is a great deck. It is, you can run your version, you can run mine at the four card swap. Like, it's not a, no difference there. It's just what you've done is brilliant. Please. There we go. That's it. G, G, G. G. Hmm. Because, like, turn one, all I need is all my cards. So I need you. Definitely don't need you. Erlen's way too early, and I have near Mancy, so I'm guaranteed to get it. Nice. That might actually work. Yes, that, Dave, though. Test it out. Test it out. I mean, this is your brainchild. It's brilliant. But huge brick potential? Potentially. But, like, look at this case, right? So we have three golds left. And the deck's already pretty much a gamble. And this would be Prince, technically. So if we had, like, access to Prince, it would be two. And your words, and who you address, and how you address them. The only thing I'm, I'm, I think I'm happy about right now is we have access to Oneiromancy, Curse Scroll, and two. Definitely Curse Scrolls, by the way. D, or that, Dave, I think it's a strict improvement over TA. Uh, in a really meaningful way. The only other one that I think is interesting is Crystal Skull as a really quick solution for Leticia to live. So I think Crystal Skull or Curse Scroll is better than TA. Do I have Archgriven in hand? Yes. Okay, Alzer's fine. I'm not worried about that. Go. You will need an ale in this matchup. Probably. That is probably an accurate statement. I have two in deck, so if it is a mill deck, not too worried. I might need to hide Erland in my hand. We might have to go a little bit early here. Depending if it's actually a mill. I don't think it's worth the uh, potential brick. Maybe, but then I get two casting curses in the deck, right? Which is pretty, pretty sweet, in my opinion. As long as they don't have Yenvo, I think we're good. If they have Yenvo and they have the double lock, we're probably going to lose. How much interaction do you have? Roy? For some reason, I knew it was going to hit there, and it actually made me really sad when I realized that. Yeah. I don't think I need Mentor here, so I'm gonna... Next move, I'm gonna Curse Scroll for AA here. Put away the Mentor. AA, get the other student out. Yeah, so I'll be able to copy the deck. Ah, you're really generous. You're far more generous than my decks are. That, Dave, I never put any card. I'm just like, here's the list, customize how you want. That makes sense, that makes sense. If you get some, like, YOLO card that lets you randomly hit, like, a bombardment kill here, I'd be very sad. Ooh, that's fine for us. Okay. Braxis, go.
That's Braxis, Mandrake, Arch Griffin. Is it Raxus, Mandrake, Arch Griffin? Like, one thing I've noticed is I keep missing one Tissia proc on all of these people, and I feel like I need to get that. There's got to be a better ordering for this. So isn't it... Hold on. I always, I keep missing a proc of this, and it's really irritating me. So we go like this. Arch Griffin. I think Arch Griffin's fine here. Put it here to avoid treason. Better play two students have casting constants. That Jeff, you that Dave, that makes sense. I think that's a mistake I'm making. Yeah, so I think I go here. Proc you. A card down? No, we're going all in here. You're getting proc no matter what. I don't think it's Mandrake. I think it's. No, it's Mandrake. Mandrake. Well. Yeah, I can do better sequencing here, guys. Yeah, that's what I'm missing. It's a band of traitors who sold us souls to kings. I'm missing the one proc here. It's so like why it's get while it's getting huge. It's it's casting contest. I'm underestimating the value of casting contest and getting an extra proc off of you because you give another 24 here, which would be awesome. Okay, cool. 150, so we did okay. Okay. Deck is brilliant. Dave, you're you're a mad genius. One of the best memes I've seen in. I don't even remember the last time I've seen a meme this good. Oh my gosh, new family member, Ozzel795. Ozzel795, welcome to the Plain Doc fam. I'm glad you joined us here today as we learn how to build a nuclear warhead. Welcome aboard. Go again in the chat, meet the people, say to me, I'll say hello to your stream six days a week, seven hours per day, and Sunday's made off. Welcome, welcome. That Dave though, that Dave though, welcome to the Plain Talk fam. You're already on Discord and you forfeit. That's it. This deck is unbelievable. Jesus Christ. Shout out to Ahmed Ali and McRandor for all their generous support on Patreon.